It's been spoken about ad nauseum. And finally, it appears like all the talk has finally borne fruit and the much-touted home for football will soon become a reality. Sports Minister Darrell Smith alluded to such when he addressed the gathering at the Addo Bolden Stadium, the venue which will now be the home to football. He stressed that with the TTFA now compliant again and its accounts updated, more funding will become available. One of the things that I would like to, to let you know that we'll be finalizing to make the Atto Bolan eventually the home of the TTFA and the home of football. They're going to be moving their offices here within the next few weeks. We're getting the AC Crawford. They'll have full access to the stadium with regards to the training. There's the training going to the back. And of course, when the irons out the, the, the figures with regards to the funding from FIFA, you're going to be seeing some new infrastructure that is going to be putting in to assist not just football, but a number of the other sporting bodies in this area could benefit from, from that uh, money that's going to be spent. Some of these infrastructural plans are set to include additional fees for training as well as a sport hall, which will house players and teams during camps for all sports using the Adobolin Stadium. The special guest of honor, FIFA President Gianni Infantino, touched on a number of issues, including a greater emphasis on the development of women's football. Another issue, which he himself said, has been given lip service, even by his own organization in the past. And David knows that very well as well. When it comes to the additional funding that FIFA is providing to each association, a part of that, between 100 and 150 thousand US dollars every year, are specifically to be dedicated to uh, women's football as well. So there will be more to come. We are about to uh, design this new strategy, which we'll present soon. And uh, I'm sure that 50% of the world population which has been left a little bit on the sideline of football, will now be fully, integrally part of football.